Tonight, we're getting our first look and learning more about the nun who was seriously injured in Tuesday's high-rise fire here in the Queen City. Sister Ruth Marie Penska was seriously burned when flames erupted inside the Marina Vista Apartments. And as we're learning, the retired nun, now in her 80s, continues to have a major impact on her local community. Ed Riley reports. She was here last week, and that's why I was so shocked when I got your call, Ed. A familiar voice is now missing from Buffalo Airwaves. It is the voice of 82-year-old sister Ruth Penska, a member of the Grey Nuns of Sacred Heart. She loved talking about life experiences, things that happened to her that week, that day, that moment. For the past eight years, Sister Ruth has been a very dedicated and popular volunteer for the Niagara Frontier Radio Reading Service for the Blind. And the great thing about radio reading is the on-off switch. So if you don't like something, you can turn it off. Well, from what I understand, when Sister Ruth came on, people cut their radios on. But this past Tuesday, Sister Ruth was rushed to ECMC in critical condition after being severely burned on her arms, legs, and torso. It happened during a fire at the Marina Vista Apartments on Hurdle Avenue, where Sister lived alone. Oh my goodness, we were, we were so shocked and appalled and just grateful to the fire department that they were able to get her. There's only about 17 great nuns locally, but all are very concerned. First of all, we're praying, and all the sisters in, in Pennsylvania are praying for her too and waiting for news and updates. News of her injuries is heartbreaking to many because Sister Ruth was very active in the Buffalo Catholic Diocese through the years. She was the former ECC campus minister, taught Spanish at DUville College, and even when she was retired, still committed herself to volunteer work. And she's an author. She, she's written two books mainly reflecting on her own life in light of scriptures. And the first one is called The, the Scoop on Ruth. Sister Ruth's name is still on the list for future assignments at the radio reading service, but her studio is empty and the microphone silent. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. And many are now praying for a Christmas miracle. Sister Ruth is now in the burn treatment center at the Erie County Medical Center. We were in contact with the hospital this afternoon and they had some encouraging news. Sister's condition has been upgraded from critical to serious. At Riley 7, Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, Ed. Now there's been